About composting, it's, it's actually imitating a process which is happening all the time in the nature. Like when organic stuff like leaves or grass or when they when they don't live anymore, when they die, yeah, then they are being uh, uh, decomposed by microorganisms like bacteria and uh, uh, also insects and worms. And uh, these microorganisms, they they need air and uh, also water and to some extent also warmth. So starting a compost in winter is uh, not the best thing to do because then it's moving really slowly. And um, uh, here, what you started here, that's quite good because, um, well, it's not a, you don't have the best conditions, yeah? Because you have a covered ground, usually you have a contact to the earth, so the microorganisms and the worms can, can come up from the earth. And as you don't have this opportunity here, then uh, it's really good that you build this pellets. And you have here uh, um, a layer which can let the air inside. And um, uh, Jan? Yeah. Jan told me you have a lot of uh, like food leftovers from which you get from uh, uh, going to the market, yeah. And uh, this is one part of, of things which go into a compost, but uh, this is usually really wet also, and uh, it also gets compressed. So then, uh, if you have a lot of these things, then there's not much air inside, and so it starts to smell. Then a different process starts, which is called fermentation, but it's not composting. Yeah, and with the composting, you have the um, advantage that it does not smell and that you get soil uh, after a while. So the microorganisms they break down the organic stuff, like like food leftovers and also stuff like this, and. Uh, then the volume is reduced in this process and uh, you, in the end you have soil, yeah? So, well, um, here you have these mixtures which are really kind of wet, so I found this on the, on the premises here. And then um, compost means actually mixture, so you start mixing it up. Maybe you can also join in, like this. We will, we will break this. Like, of course, we don't need the plastic, so maybe uh, cut it up. And that's also the major technique, yeah? You, you mix materials of which are, have different um, features, yeah? Like stuff which is wet, then you mix with dry stuff and you mix Fine, fine materials with uh, rough materials, and the the main thing which you keep in mind is that you are sort of feeding small, small living beings, which need food and uh, air and water. Um, and whenever do you have problems like smell? Then you know from this, okay, it's not enough air inside, it's too much water. That's when the composting process stops and the fermentation starts. And then you need to put in, uh, to stop for a while giving too much wet things, or you need to put in more dry materials. Dry materials here. So this could be a wood, just uh, like uh, pieces so of uh, even the pallets. Um, it could be, but uh, those are the. This are the uh, wood. Is the thing which takes the most time to break down. When you mix it with shit mm -hmm. or pee, then it's better. Oh, so then you can because then there's a different sort of, of microorganism which, which also can digest this mixture of... And, uh, but uh, if 
you can use here cardboard, like like yeah cardboard, but you have to tear it in, in pieces like this, and then like roll it or yeah. just uh, tear it. Tear it. Yeah. Uh, yeah. It's yeah. important how big pieces are in the pile of compost. Yeah. So how how big is it important how big pieces? Yeah. So like even if it's uh, organic like the food and everything, mm -hmm. is it uh, important to chop it? Yeah, like it uh, like the, the the smaller the pieces are, then the bigger the surface is, and so the better the microorganisms can digest it. But then we also like if you have something like like a porridge, yeah, then they have the problem again there's not much air inside. So you always keep keep it, keep it in balance. Yeah. Yeah, here I, I asked, mm -hmm. do you find some of the So here, I think here, if you leave it like this, then it's, the wind can dry it out. So I, I would suggest to put some more planks here, mm -hmm. so to protect it a bit more from the wind. Yeah. 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 Also, that's like, yeah, it's quite nice. And like, uh, Things which should rather not go into the combos are usually cooked food leftovers because they attract rats. That's the concern, yeah? If you have cooked food leftovers, either you have something which cannot be where rats cannot enter. Yeah, yeah like with the, yeah, that's yeah, somewhat difficult. So and also, like, uh, when you have cats, and like the, the shit from the cats also should be good. So, we are now going to Yeah. And, um, like, like, the way how you do it <coughs> depends a bit on your opportunities, yeah? Like, if you have no contact to the ground and you need to build something like this. You can also have the compost inside where you have the, the contact to the ground. Yeah. yeah, we was worried about the smell actually, that's why we ah. decided to... It wasn't a begin the mm -hmm. even place it there, but after we start thinking like... Mm -hmm. And the flies to the... Uh, ah, yeah. Okay, that's two, two, two problems, like the smell and the flies. Uh, then the simple thing is just to, to cover always properly with, with something dry, with a little bit of earth also. Uh, yeah, like sawdust also, you can cover it with sawdust also. Yeah. And then the, the flies, they uh, cannot, they will not come. Yeah. Uh, anyway, a compost like this. And which house is uh, very wet? It's a lot of water. It's a wet, yeah. yeah. And then you keep this. So okay. you kind of put it a bit so. And then you get some of the dry stuff again. Like here. So every time you put in kitchen waste, then you cover them afterwards. Okay. And so in this way, you prevent the smells and the flies. Okay, do you find something which is not really good to put in? Or? No, I think with all these fruit stuff, that's uh, it's okay. Yeah? So it's like, well, this is quite compact, so it will take a longer time. Mm -hmm. yeah.